So in my hunt for the ultimate fidget toys, sensory toys, whatever you want to call them, I've landed on these. This is called a monkey noodle. You stretch it, pull it, twirl it, wrap it, squeeze it. I guess it's from a company called Impressa. I never heard of them before. And uh, not really anything in the way of instructions. These are monkey noodles in a uh, pretty small size. Maybe it's called the normal size or the medium size. And we'll see if we can get the length here. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, about 11 inches long. And what a monkey noodle is, it's a sort of a gummy gel substance. It's not sticky. Uh, it's kind of like the grip on a pen. It's soft, so it's uh, denser than jello, but uh, softer than the grip of a pen. And basically, it's something you just play with while you're, you know, uh, waiting for uh, your, you know, something to download, waiting for your, you know, something to render, uh, listening to a talk and you're just feeling like fidgeting, you have this cube right here. I don't know what this little piece of, that's just from when it was manufactured. You get five of them in the pack, pink, orange, green, purple. There's a blue one somewhere around here. They're all the same. And basically you play with it by stretching it. You know, you could twirl it around. You could tie it in a knot. Now you could tie it in a knot. Uh, you could stretch these things. The company says up to eight feet. So it's about a foot long. So you could stretch it. Uh, I don't know. Maybe not eight feet. I think six feet is what they said. So you could stretch it to, uh, you know, about five or six times its length. That's kind of distracting. It's not really something you would do at the desk. Uh, you know, you could see this one has been kicking around for a couple weeks. Starting to pick up some wear. Uh, these things are, you know, the... It's about $12 for the five pack, maybe $10 for the five pack. So like two, three bucks each. So not that cheap uh, as far as just like a, a toy if you need to buy a bunch of them, but they're not too expensive overall. And you know, they're fun. You can kind of twirl them around. They're essentially silent, which is nice here. That's about as loud as they get. You know, even if you, if you snap it, basically no noise, nothing really when you hit it on the desk, just normal stretching and playing there's no noise doesn't leave any residue on your hand your hand feels slightly uh kind of like uh slightly slippery as if this thing was uh you know had a kind of a, a base as opposed to being acidic to it there's nothing on your hands but again they feel they do feel slippery maybe this thing has a little oil on it or again maybe it's just slightly basic i don't really know uh what the deal with that is so you could see some wear and cracking. I don't feel like this thing's gonna crack anytime soon though. So I feel like you're definitely gonna get a few weeks, even a few months of use out of this. At that point, it'll start getting, you know, a little beat up and maybe you overstretch it a few times and it's time to move on to the next one. That's why it comes in a five pack. Uh, I, as a fidget toy or a sensory toy, I actually find these ones to be rather boring and not very satisfying. I wouldn't really recommend them. Uh, you know, you could tie it into some fun knots, uh, but the knots don't really work so well unless you're looking at it. And then really you're just stretching it, you know, wrapping it around your finger, stuff like that. Uh, I don't know. I just, I, it's not something I find to be particularly satisfying. The reviews, reviews on Amazon are really quite positive. People seem to like them. Maybe it's more for uh, children. Someone that's getting more satisfaction out of the uh, kind of the, uh, the tactile feel of this the sort of the gumminess i'm sure for smaller hands where this thing is offering more resistance it's probably possibly more satisfying which this is you know relatively larger for for me uh and i just don't really find them to be that enjoyable you know you can stretch them out for a little bit but after a couple seconds uh my hands feel kind of slippery and weird and i'm not really having fun anymore so those are the monkey noodles uh interesting sensory toy great reviews on amazon and other places but uh, not for me. Thanks for watching.